loss turned to inspiration for one Topeka family. This weekend, they're remembering a child they lost with an all-American pastime. KSNT News reporter James Ryan is live in Southeast Topeka with all the details on the Easton Moore Memorial Lemonade Stand. James? That's right, Hannah. I am outside the Shawnee Heights Elementary School, and I'll be honest, I don't go to many uh, lemonade stands, but this one here earlier today, I got the lemonade, I got a cupcake, I even got a Rice Krispie treat that I couldn't help but eat on the way here. Honestly, it was the people that really tugged at my heartstrings. There's only one word to describe the lemonade at the Easton Moore Memorial Stand. Delicious. Best. I got pink lemonade, so I'd highly recommend that. Because the lemonade is delicious. You need to come out and get you some if you haven't, because it's great. And that's thanks to nine-year-old Cameron Moore. Cameron has put on the lemonade stand for the past five years, rain or shine. The rain kind of stopped us a little bit from the customers, but as long as they keep coming, I keep serving. Cameron started the Lemonade Span in honor of his three-year-old brother Easton, who died from a heart defect back in 2013. Each year, the stand sells lemonade, cupcakes, and other baked goods, raising thousands of dollars for kids just like his brother. He had Tark to help him with everything and his special needs, and they would give him, um, they would buy him special stuff that he needed. Cameron's dad, Christopher, says he's in awe of what his son has been able to accomplish. To see your son take something that was, you know, such a dark moment in our lives and turn it into something bright by giving it back to other people, and he's very passionate about it, and, and it's something I'm very proud of, for sure. Because when life gives you lemons, you sell lemonade. Along with donating to TARC, the Moors tell me that they're going to set $1,000 aside to start their own nonprofit to help kids with special needs. So come on down tomorrow, get a sweet treat, and give to a good cause. I'm James Ryan, KSNT News. James, you got a little frosty in there, but it's all right. We won't hold it against you. Well, just like James said, the Easton Moore Memorial Lemonade Stand does continue tomorrow from 9 a.m. to 4 p.m. outside of Shawnee Heights Elementary.